Hey everyone, today I am going to be swatching two of the new Makeup Revolution and Friends <laughs> palettes. I <laughs> Oh, my cat is being a brat. Hi, Simon. I have the Joey palette and the Chandler palette, so if you want to see swatches of both of these palettes, just keep watching. So you get nine eyeshadows, you get one, two, three, four, five mattes, and then the rest are metallics. The formulas look really fun, and I love this color story. I like that there are bright colors. Bright colors are my vibes. It also does come with a little mirror, which I think is so cute. The palette swatched really well. They don't have any issues with any of the shades. They swatch really well. We all know swatches don't dictate how they will work on the eyes, but the eyeshadow swatched well. Now I want to talk about the formulas. The mattes I like. I really like the matte formula. I've used Revolution eyeshadows before, so I roughly know how I like their formula, and I really like the mattes. Now the shimmers are not my favorite formula in this palette. They're more so like chunky if that makes sense um some of them you can blend in like the shade dr drake and nap partner if you blend them in a little bit then they work much better but this shade jr is just very very chunky and i'm not sure how that would translate on the lid it's a pretty shade but it's just not my favorite formula for shimmers the shade Bamboozled, though, is just like your typical, like, metallic-y shimmer formula, which I would have preferred, honestly. Those, that's just the type of formula that I'm used to, but the shades in this palette are really pretty. I'm excited to try it out. My favorite shade is probably the matte Hot Hot Pink. I love hot pinks like that. I could definitely see myself doing, like, a kind of sunset vibe with that all over the lid and blended with the orange and the yellow. I think that it's a very, very pretty shade. I also like mostly all the shades in this palette, the bright shades anyway. The shade Joey is like this like very light, light tan shade. It's pretty. I'm not sure. I guess I would use that as a transition shade, but for the most part, I like the bright shades, the matte specifically. The shimmers I am intrigued to use, but they're not my favorite formula, so I'm not sure how I'm going to like them but swatch wise they swatched beautifully and i'm excited to try this there's a tiny tiny bit of staining from the hot pink but not usually as bad as shades like that are so i'm very impressed the chandler palette is probably my favorite color wise i just love the like pastel vibes it gives i love the blue shades the shade tulsa I had to swatch because it just looked so beautiful. Unfortunately, it's kind of like a topper shade, but even so, it's very, very beautiful. So this is like the palette that I was most excited for. The Chandler palette is definitely my favorite. I love the pastel vibes. I love how the shades swatched. They all swatched really, really well. The shade Hello Mr. Bing is like a white with like the tiniest hint of like bl a blue tint to it it's pretty it definitely doesn't show up that well on my skin because i am so pale that being said i think it would be beautiful to like set the brow bone or the inner corner or whatever i definitely would recommend using like a white base with the pastel shades just because that's how pastels work a little bit better oh you're moving now okay like i said 
swatches don't dictate how these will work on the eyes, especially with pastel shades. They can be very tricky to formulate, but they swatched really well, so I am very excited and I have high hopes. I don't feel like they'll like work bad on the lid just because of how pigmented they are. Probably the least pigmented of the pastels is the shade Erica, which is the purple, which kind of sucks because purple is my favorite, but it's kind of like a very light sort of like a lavender type shade. It's pretty, but that's the shade that I don't think will work well on the lid. I feel like if anything, it would be good as like a transition, but I don't think it would work good by itself, like all over the lid or anything. That being said, I definitely prefer the shimmers in this palette than the Joey palette. I just love these formulas a bit more. They're less chunky and more so metallic and like sparkly, which is definitely my vibes. The shade Tulsa is still my favorite, which is that like blue topper. I would personally even use that as a highlighter. It's so pretty. But honestly, I love the vibes in this palette. I love the blue tones, the green, the pinks. Like I just think it's such a beautiful palette. That being said, if I did have to choose some favorite shades, Tulsa would be my favorite shimmer, and then Hypnosis would be my favorite matte. I just love those two shades. I think they'd also be really pretty together, in all honesty. I think that they'd be very, very beautiful together. Like, I just love this palette so much. It's definitely my favorite of the two, just because of the colors. I think it's a bit more unique, if I'm being honest. Like, the Joey palette's definitely still pretty. But those are like typical shades, whereas these are a little bit more fun and different, especially all together. I don't have a palette with these shades like all together, so I think it's fun. I also do appreciate that they have like this like more so of like a natural shade. But the fact is, is that it's super like glittery, which I love. I love that. It makes me want to use it, which is like I'm not a natural eyeshadow type of person. But I could definitely see myself doing a pink look and then using that on the lid. I think it would be absolutely stunning i definitely think that both palettes are really pretty i love that they both have like colorful eyeshadows the ross palette is completely like natural so i think there's something for everyone if you're a fan of friends i think that you will enjoy this regardless i grew up watching friends so like and i haven't tried any of the collaborations so far so i'm very very excited for these these are definitely up my alley i love bright colors so these are the ones i'm definitely happy to have i think that it's a fun like dynamic i think that i love that you could also pair the palettes together if you wanted like you have some more like pastel tones here and then you have bright tones obviously that being said, let me know down below which one is your favorite of the two. Obviously for me, it's the Chandler palette. I just love that palette so, so much. It's just so pretty. The shade Hypnosis honestly gets me every time. It's just such a pretty, like, minty green type of shade, and I'm very excited to use that all over the lid. I'm really, really hoping that these eyeshadows perform well. I feel like they will because they swatched well, which, again, we know doesn't mean anything, but... I've tried the Makeup Revolution formulas before and I like it, so I am very excited to try these on the eyes. I will definitely do some TikTok makeup tutorials for you guys and I'll make sure to post in my YouTube community tab as well looks when I do them. I'm going to try and do a look very, very soon too, so keep an eye out for that. I think I'm going to use the Chandler palette first just because I am so excited for it. And honestly, these make me so excited. I ordered some Hollow Taco nail polishes like some pretty like spring and summer vibe ones so I'm very excited for those and like this just makes me feel super like spring summer vibes like the pastels made me think spring and then these bright shades make me think summer honestly thank you guys so much for watching this video I hope you enjoyed if you did make sure you subscribe or comment down below any videos you'd like to see me do go follow my instagram and tiktok make it by tasha xo and I'll see you in the next video bye I have such a cute cuddle buddy I do Hi. Hi. Hi, baby. How are you? How are you? Oh, he's stepping right on your brother. <laughs> yeah. Hmm? You want attention? You want attention? My goodness. Oh, oh. Someone's sleepy, huh? You sleepy?
เอโรเซียมเซียมโลกิทาเบลีโอเกนิสโอเกนิสอีเซเจสวีดีไปอีเซเจสวีดีไป